Chaloba, Nicolas Jackson, Moses Casado, Mark Cuellar, Copama. In fact, the entire Chelsea, even Pochettino, fellow Blues, it's as if probably the rest of our matches, they will put them on night fixture. Because as if midweek matches, night fixture, Chelsea team is very, very composed. Like today, we displayed a very fantastic performance right from the very first minute of the game. So it's Chelsea 2, Tottenham All Sports 2. It's now on record that we'll be able to uh, get league double against Tottenham. It's been a long time we last won a league double against Tottenham. Uh, that is the first leg. It was 4 1. Nicolas Jackson scoring an hat trick and also Kopama starting a penalty. Then coming to today's game, a lot of rival fans will be saying Tottenham are going to beat Chelsea because Tottenham are actually fighting for a Champions League position. So it's now on record that Tottenham fan, Tottenham as a club, whenever they think about Chelsea, they will start having nightmare because in 2016 we stopped Tottenham from lifting the league and Leicester confirmed the champion. So today's win has also added further salt in sports injury by leaving their chances of qualifying for a Champions League with a very tiny thread. While Chelsea are edging closer to European sport, we finally moved to the eighth position after almost two years on dragging the twelfth and also the ninth position. So finally, we are now in the eighth position. We'll be looking for the rest of our matches. If we can get all wins, who knows? We can be snatching the seventh position and qualifying for uh, European sports. So, fellow Blues and lovers of Chelsea, it was an interesting encounter for those persons who failed to watch the Chelsea game. While for a rival fan, it's a big blow for them because they expected Chelsea to have lost this match. So, the first half, a courtesy of Chaloba, we were able to go uh, one go up. Then, the second half, though, we didn't really start the second half uh, very well. Tottenham was uh, we're pressing us, we we're coming out. Are trying to draw level, but we are able to get the second row courtesy of Nicola Jackson after Kopama's brilliant way taking free kick hit the crossbar. Nicola Jackson was fast enough to react to it and make it two goals for us. So it's a good one for the Senegalese international, a good performance for him. And also kudos to the academic boys Achim Achim Pong who came in to a uh, sorry Achim Pong who came in for decrease and also the other academic graduates who made a senior appearance for Chelsea today. However, guys, the Chelsea boys did fantastically well, including Pochettino, to have been able to have managed this entire Chelsea situation. Remember, we've been rocked with so much injury. See, 14 senior players are out with injury. So, leaving Pochettino with no option than to fill our bench with academic graduates. The only recognized person on the Chelsea bench was Cesar Casadi. And you agree with me that even Cesar Casadi is an infringe player who was recently called back from loan during the January transfer window. So you could see Mauricio Pochettino actually did well managing the Chelsea side, beating his former side today at Stamford Bridge. So fellow Blues and lovers of Chelsea, if you know you are excited with this win, you are happy with this win, go over to the comment section to leave a comment below and also do well to share this video. Do have a lovely night rest, fellow Blues. Bye.